A woolly rhino in a remarkable state of preservation has been discovered. The Pleistocene beast is now being studied by scientists at the Academy of Sciences of the Republic of Saka, Yakutia. The frozen carcass was found in Abiski Ulus in August 2020, but has only recently been transported for research purposes. The preliminary age of the find is 20 to 50,000 years, and around 80% of it has been preserved. Experts at the Department for the Study of Mammoth Fauna of the Academy of Sciences of the Republic of Saka, Yakutia, told of the scientific significance of the find, which immediately became a world sensation. On the 26th of January, scientists held a presentation of the find, which was delivered to the Yakutsk from the Abiski Ulus shortly before. Alexander Savin, a resident of the Abiski Ulus, said, During the tour, we looked for the remains of ancient animals, bones, tusks, soft tissues. In the place where the glacier thawed, we saw a piece of wool sticking out of the ice. At first, they thought it was some kind of small animal. Two days later, when the permafrost thawed, we saw that it was a large animal and immediately alerted the scientists of the Academy of Sciences of Yakutia. Valery Plotnikov, a leading researcher, said, The first inspection of the rhino was done immediately upon arrival at the Abiskiulus. By that time, the carcass had already been placed in the glacier to prevent soft tissue thawing. They made a a morphological description and conducted a survey of the territory. From the point of view of logistics, it was most convenient to wait for winter and deliver the carcass to Yakutsk via the winter road. Gennady Bueskarov, chief researcher of the Department for the Study of Mammoth Fauna at the Academy of Sciences of the Republic of Saka, Yakutia, said the woolly rhinoceros was adapted to the cold climate of the Ice Age and was widespread in Eurasia. I must say that these animals were not numerous and did not form large herds, like, for example, mammoths. In this regard, their remains are less common than mammoths or other fossil animals. He added, The study of the Abisci rhinoceros will give us a lot of information in different branches of science and paleontology and geology and paleoecology, histology and zoology. Through their research, scientists hope to obtain information not only about the life of this particular animal, but also about its diet, habitat and even the flora of that period. Woolly rhinoceroses shared their habitat with humans, but direct evidence that they interacted is relatively rare. Only 11% of the known sites of prehistoric Siberian tribes have remains or images of the animal. Signs that early humans hunted or scavenged woolly rhinos came from markings on the discovered animal's bones. One specimen had injuries caused by human weaponry, with traces of a wound from a sharp object present. The fearsome beast clearly made an impact on early man, however, as it appears in cave paintings like the Chauvet Cave in southeastern France. Research, via disputed radiocarbon dating, indicates the animals could still have been roaming the landscape as recently as 8000 BC in western Siberia. So a fascinating discovery that could tell us a lot about woolly rhinos, but also about the conditions in which early man lived. That's all for this video. Don't forget to like, share and most importantly subscribe. Thank you for watching.